Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kayla here. Thank you all so much for clicking on today's video. I'm really excited about this one because springtime is right around the corner and I've been really inspired lately to just go ahead and redecorate the entire house. Currently, our home is still in Christmas mode, which is crazy, but we've had a lot going on. If you're not updated yet, check out my community posts or check out the YouTube short that I made. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys all the things that I've picked up because I've been doing a lot of like retail therapy. It's been really, really fun seeing all the great things that are out for springtime. And because I didn't actually film myself buying these things in store, I'm bringing you guys today a huge springtime haul. So sit back, relax, and let's start off with the things that I got from Amazon. Okay, so my word for springtime that's gonna like describe my whole style is in bloom. Throughout my whole home, I just want greenery everywhere. I want it to feel alive, to feel fresh, to feel joyous and happy. So from Amazon, I picked up some florals, which I've never bought florals from Amazon before. But right here we have like this greenery and I'll have everything linked down below. I'm not sure what type of leaf this is supposed to resemble, but I got a pack of five. They sell smaller packs. But basically, I'm gonna be using this as vase filler, so I'm still on the hunt for a cute vase. However, these are so easy to bend and move. I've already been playing with them. And the stems are so long, so one little trick that I learned before is instead of cutting these, I used to cut them. Now, just bend them to the sides of like whatever vase it is that you have. So like I said, I'm still in the hunt for like a cute pitcher or vase to put these in, but look how beautiful that is. They look so realistic too. The next thing I got in this box are some tulips and I got a 30 piece set. And I am also really excited about these two, you guys. Let me show you. So when you open the box, this is what they look like. And they have so many colors, but I just decided to go ahead and get the classic white color. So these tulips are so realistic. You guys, like what? And I think the pack of 30 was only like $16.99. So if you can imagine these just being in a vase, you know, tulips, they like droop over a bit or a lot of it usually. And they're so flexible, you guys, like, oh. I have so many that I'm just gonna fill them up in a big vase and have them all like drooping over a little bit. I'm gonna pop these into the kitchen next to the window and it's gonna look so, so beautiful. So yeah, there's so many in here. I also might put some in the bathroom depending on like the vase that I find for these, but ah, so cute. Okay y'all, and the last thing that I got from Amazon in this big old box right here is an olive tree. I've wanted one of these for a really long time. So we'll see if the quality is good and we're gonna open it together. Okay y'all, so we just got out the box and it comes in two parts as you can see. So we have the base here and then like the tree part. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this off real quick. Okay. So the tree is a good height. So I'm thinking this is gonna go over by the fireplace and I need to get an actual pot for it to go in. But I really, really like it, you guys. And this is an Amazon find. It's my first time I ever bought something like a tree off Amazon and it's a win. Okay, you guys, so our spring collection for Sweet May Street will be launching on this day, and I am super duper excited about it. Put a lot of thought into this collection, pouring my heart into it, so I hope you guys really enjoy it. It's a smaller collection this time, but the pieces are chef's kiss. So starting off, you know I love a good dish towel. So we have this one that says home sweet home and a little house on it. And the whole towel is like full of little houses. And of course you already know it has a hook so you can hang it up in your kitchen. 
Next, this is another one of my favorite items. Y'all know I love measuring cups and these, these measuring cups have like a cute little handle on the side. So the biggest one is one and a half cup. And then this little mini one is one fourth cup. This one is one half cup. This one is one cup. And then the blue one is one and a half cup. And like, look at these colors. They're just so, so perfect. I love them so, so much. Oh, can't wait to put this in my kitchen. Our next spring item that we have are these beautiful knit pot holders. You guys love these. We sell out of these for every single collection. So I'm really excited about this colorway. So you have this really pretty celery green and then this nice neutral brown color. And pair it together, they look really, really cute and earthy for springtime. Here is our next item. I love this bowl so 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 much like the details are so intricate and unique and the little bunny on top is so to die for i'm thinking i'm gonna add like a whole bunch of little chocolate eggs in here so within our spring collection we have tons of succulents for you guys to enjoy of course in the springtime i feel like we all want to add tons of greenery within the house so these are the greenery options that we have available there are five different types of succulent and they're each sold individually and i personally love like the neutral carton that these come in they're so tiny and cute. I think they'll be perfect on y'all's bookcases, your kitchens, anywhere, bathrooms. Literally, they're all so gorgeous. All right, and for another one of my favorite items, we have this really cute mug, y'all. It's the most perfect shade of blue, like a cute little denim shade. But the thing that makes it really unique to me is the handle, like the little knot, the rope knot right here. I love that so, so, so much. This is perfect for tea, coffee, hot chocolate, whatever you're drinking this springtime, and these will both be sold individually. Next up in our spring collection, we have this beautiful little butter dish. I'm so excited about this. So we have a little bunny up here on top, and then when you open it, of course, there is like a little tray for you to put your butter. But also, if you're someone who hosts a lot, you could put cheese here if you wanted to. I mean, honestly, you could put anything here or just not put anything at all and leave it out for decoration purposes but it is absolutely adorable so simple and cute this is definitely a neutral item that's like a subtle nod to easter you know like you're festive you're in the mood but it's not doing too much i love items like this and next we have this beautiful stand which is so cute and rustic each one is actually unique in terms of like the wood and kind of like the distressing that's on each one so i'm thinking this is gonna go in my kitchen and i'm gonna put my soap on it i love stands like these because they're so versatile they can be used literally anywhere within the home next up we have this cute little ball these are i know i said everything's pretty much my favorite but i really 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 love these bowls they're so so cute so i don't quite know how i'm gonna style it in my home just yet i thought about just putting my keys in it but it also will look cute with like a whole bunch of easter eggs inside of it with a little speckled print so definitely stay tuned to how i style this in my next video actually how i style everything in the next video we have a few more things coming for our spring collection, so please, please stay tuned. Our collection goes live on this day, and also I have a 10% off coupon code for you guys, which will be left right here, so you guys can shop. I'm really, really excited about this collection, and it's gonna be a great one. And the next place that I did quite a lot of shopping at is Hobby Lobby. You guys know they have certain things 50% off every other week. So I got these frames and I think they're really cutie. I love the art shape in them and then also like the wood tones. This is the year that we really want to get our floors refinished in the house and we'd like for them to be like this lighter wood tone. So I got some of these to go within the bookcases because this is also the year that we are going to decorate those to the nines, to the teeth, to the, just make them really cute, you know? And I also got this little vase to go in the bookcases as well. It is so, so pretty. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this vase. I just love the color of it. Like it kind of plays tricks with your eyes a little bit. Like sometimes when I look at it, it seems gray. Other times it looks like a dark green-ish color. So super duper pretty. And then for the bedroom, which we're also putting in spring mode, I got this little trinket stand, jewelry stand thing because I just want a place to put all my accessories. 
itself my rings my necklaces they're kind of just all over the place right now so this is going to be perfect to house all of that and i love how vintage it looks it's so cute okay so like I said, we know that florals are a big thing for springtime. And you guys, look at these cosmos that I got from Hobby Lobby. These look so realistic. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. And these were actually 50% off. So I got, let's see, four stems. So the original price on these is $7.99. Again, florals are on sale every other week so you can snack them for 50% off like I did. And I cannot wait to put these in a vase. I think it's going to be the cutest thing ever. So let's see what's in here. I kind of forgot. Oh yeah, that's right. I got this cute little colander thingy, which I plan to put a lot of my berries in. Speaking of kitchen, I also got some new cleaning utensils. This one was $5.99 and then this one was $4.99, but they were 40% off because they're part of the Spring Shop collection. And I got one of these during fall time and I absolutely love it. So when I saw this one with a little handle, I was like, I gotta have it. I cannot wait to use these. So excited. Y'all know I'm a sucker for a good dish towel and this is the one that I picked up for this spring season at Hobby Lobby. The price on this was $8.99 and y'all also know I love the sage color. But that's another thing, like should we paint the door sage for spring and going into summer? Like sage is actually the everyday color for the door when it's not in seasonal mode. Or should I paint it a pale yellow? Oh, you guys. So I'm really excited about these because we're also going to be redoing the front of the house pretty soon, repainting a few things, and this color is going to be incorporated. Um, Hubby actually doesn't want me to paint the shutters this color, but I feel like for spring, I want our home to look like a little cottage. So I picked up these. On the inside and outside, I want it to look like a cottage. So anyways, for the dining room table, I bought four of these little circular, what are these called? Placements, right? Yeah. They were $5.99 a piece before the 40% off. And I love the little ridges on them. I think they look, the ruffles I mean, they look so dainty and cutie. So yeah, this is the color that we are gonna be incorporating a lot. This like really pretty grayish blue color. You're gonna see it all over the place. Blue lately has just become my happy color for some reason. All right, and I've got a few more things from Hobby Lobby. These little green balls I thought were adorable. They were $5.99 but 50% off. So I'm planning to put all three of these on like a really long wooden tray actually right here behind me on the TV console. So you guys, you hear that beautiful sound? So beautiful. This is our first ever wind chime that we're gonna install on the back patio and I cannot wait to hear this ever so often when the wind blows. I have a, like a very special place in my heart for wind chimes. All right, you guys know Easter is right around the corner and this is pretty much my color palette for my fashion, but also for the home. And so I, we picked up these speckled eggs from Hobby Lobby. I love them so much. The natural creamy color and the sage and the blue. They're so, so pretty. So I'll probably take them out of this carton and just scatter them everywhere. So one thing about us, y'all, the mail just ends up on the coffee table. Marcus is in charge of like getting the mail at the mailbox, so anytime he brings it in, he places it right on the coffee table. And then I'm in charge of going through the mail. And so, sometimes the mail just be sitting on the coffee table, and it makes the coffee table look really cluttered. So, we're trying to streamline the process here. And we got a little post box, or a little mailbox for inside of the house. So that way when Marcus brings in the mail and puts it in here, I hopefully by the end of every week, every week, I am going to go through it, empty out what we don't need, take a look at what's important, and then, you know, every week we'll start off with a fresh and clean mailbox. So I love the natural tones in this. I think it's so pretty and I love the font of the word post and like the little floral right here. Last thing that we got from Hobby Lobby were these cute little hooks right here. So I got these because in our kitchen, 
we have a piece of countertop that sticks out further than the cabinet, which is intentional. But with that space underneath there, we could be using it for something that we currently aren't. So I came up with the idea of putting some hooks down there so that way when I come in, I can put either Marshy's leash on there or I can put my purse on there and um, it kind of be out of the way. Because right now when I come in, I put my purse on like the corner of the chair in the dining room. So I just want to make sure that everything this year has like a proper place. Like this is where it's supposed to go. So hopefully these help out with that. These were $5.99, but 50% off of that price, which is a really good deal. Now we are moving into Target, which is where I got the bulk of my stuff from. I'll admit, I went a little crazy on Target.com. Most of the stuff was sent to the house. And then I went to Target and I saw more things that I liked. So yeah, your girl kind of went insane in Target, but everything that I got is super cute. Starting off with this huge tray, which is the one that I was saying is gonna go right behind me on this little console. So when I bought it online, I didn't actually know it was this long and this big. So those three little balls that I bought to go on it, um, we're gonna need something else to fill this out. So depending on, because the TV is kind of low, I was thinking like I could put a vase here and then the three little balls. I don't know, we're gonna style this together in my next video. You guys see all this stuff styled in my next video. But earlier I showed you guys the placemats that we're gonna use. So I went ahead and bought some napkins to go with them. This is the pair that I am most excited about because I love the colors, like that really pretty blue. And then we have the green and the pink. So they're totally spring vibes. You get a pack of two of these at Target for like five bucks, which I think is amazing. And then I also got an everyday pack of white, which just comes in a four pack um, for $10. So yeah, I think that's gonna be really cute. I, wonder, I really wanna get into making like really beautiful and elaborate tablescapes. So I've been working my way up, if you guys have noticed, maybe not, but we'll see what we come up with for springtime. In the spring mood, I also got some florals. So these little seeds here because I do want to plant some things outside and we're going to try to grow wildflowers again. We tried last year before the wedding and they didn't, they just didn't grow. So this year we are going to give another stab at it and we're going to put them in a new location this time where hopefully there's a lot more sun and according to like the little chart on the back, it actually says that it's time to plant these now. So we will probably plant these in the next video and lately i've been really loving being outside and like feeling the sun on my skin feeling the breeze so i think it'll be nice to have like an outdoor job to go and do every day and these are 4.99 a piece i don't know when seeds got so expensive but you know where i can find some cheap seeds let me know just in case these don't work out all right also for the stove in the kitchen this is from the threshold line and I love how simple it is. It just says spoon. And usually the spoon holders that I get to go on the stove, they have like the long piece right here. And I liked how this one did it. And this one was, I believe this was five bucks, which I thought was a great deal. And you already know I got more florals and plants from Target. So these little cuties I thought were adorable. What really sold me on these were the planters that they're in. I love the color of them so 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 much i think they're great so i got two different varieties and actually got two of each because i want to create symmetry in the bookcases and these are definitely going to find their home in the bookcases somewhere all right and of course we've got more greenery from target this one was 29.99 and again i love like the pot that it's in i feel like it is so 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 pretty I love pots that have like texture and coloring that's pretty like unique. It doesn't look too perfect basically. So that's what I'm going for. So um, this is from the Hearth and Home. Oh wait, I, just, I always say Hearth and Home. But this is from the Hearth and Hand Collection at Target. And I'll have to play with these leaves a little bit more. But if you want like a dupe of 
this literally get the like long stems from Amazon and throw them into any vase and you basically can replicate this for so much cheaper and then this is the other little plant that I got from the hearth and hand collection again the planter is what sold me on this you guys like I love the way this planter looks it's so pretty like the glossiness of it, the ridges, the cream tones of the browns, and I love the fact that the plant is like drooping over it. I feel like that's so cute. I saw these candlestick holders from Target and I was like, yes, just yes. Give them to me now, please. So this one was $11.99 for the bigger one and this little baby was $7.99, which I thought was a great deal. And these are gonna go on the fireplace mantle. So I'm really excited about these and I actually ended up getting two of each because I wasn't sure if I wanted like them to go on either end of the fireplace so we'll see when we decorate how these like work but I I'm really excited about them so that's the first pair and then here's the second pair of them and this is what they look like on the inside and they should hold just like a regular um tapered candlestick and I'll probably use like a white or cream one and then next, I got this little tray, which I'm really, really excited about. I don't know, it's just something about it that I thought was really cute. Now this was $30, which for the size of it, isn't too, too bad. What I really loved about it is that, like the wicker and the way it's braided and weed really reminded me of like spring and Easter. So I'm thinking this will go in the kitchen and I might put like a lot of our fruits on it that we'll be eating for this season. Okay, we're down to the last few bags from Target and pretty much, oh no, I was about to say all this stuff is from the dollar spot, but it's not. So let me show you the stuff that's not from the dollar spot first. And it's really just these cute candles. Oh, and a doormat. So, I got this candle right here because of the color. Like I said, that blue color is our vibe for springtime this year. And this is the scent Coconut Water and Orchid. And it smells so good. I believe this can was $13, which I thought was a really great deal. Not only because of like the container that it's in, but also it has the wooden wicks, which I love because they snap, crackle, and pop. And it's such a cozy sound. And then the next candle that I got is sandalwood white amber. Oh, <laughs> white cedar and amber. And it has two wicks and it smells so good. Like all of these scents just smell so fresh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It just smells so good. I cannot wait to burn these. I can't wait for the house to be clean and all the Christmas stuff to be gone. And just to have like a fresh start. Now I'm like the core related thing, but I got some power paste because everyone has been raving about this and like how clean they can get your pans. And some of my pans, like the back of them, look really crispy dusty. So I want to try this and see if it works. The smell of it is actually pretty good. This is what it looks like. And it comes with a scrub mommy. It smells really fresh, so we'll see y'all. Cause in the next video, we're gonna be cleaning, organizing, and redecorating this whole house. So we'll test it together. And here's the next thing. Like I feel like out of everything that I got, this is my favorite item. Y'all, I love this so, so, so much. And it's so simple, it just says welcome home. But it's the shape of it that is everything to me. It feels so like cottagey. And you guys know we're gonna be redoing the whole front. So you won't see this in the next video, but you'll see it when we redecorate the front for spring. We're kind of waiting for like all the florals to come out at Home Depot. But definitely some tulips out there and whatever else we can put in the window boxes. We're gonna be repainting the shutters and the front door. And when I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, it's perfect. It's so perfect. All right, y'all, we're down to the last few things from the Target Dollar Spot. So I got these little bunnies and they're grass bunnies. Oh, also that doormat was $20. So here's the little bunnies. I love them, they're so cute. So this one was five, and then this little mini was three. Where are these gonna go? I don't know, but I saw them, and I was like, they look so, to me, these look so expensive looking. So I was like, I gotta have them. 
It was also five, and it's kind of like this little golden bunny. Isn't he so cute, you guys? All right, y'all, and the last thing from Target, I guess like, yeah, is this little charcuterie board. It was only $5, and they had a bigger version, a thicker version that was available for $20. is Urban Outfitters and we're also like I said redoing the bedroom so we picked up these new I was gonna say sheets but it's just a duvet and one pillowcase um and it was on sale but the reason I got it was again that really pretty blue color and I liked all the florals that were on it Right, you guys and last I'm gonna show you the things that we got from like TJ Maxx, Ross, Marshalls and those type of places so again you know I love dish towels so here is like it's a set of two actually that was only $7.99 and I love the little fringe at the bottom like this yellow color is so so pretty so yeah I'm excited about these and we also got a really big basket from Ross so a lot of times when we come in, we kind of just leave our shoes in the kitchen right next to the fridge. So that calls for, or what happens is, a lot of shoes end up being there because we don't always wear the same shoe every day when we leave the house. And a lot of dirt gets there as well. So this, we're gonna actually leave in the dining room. So that way you, you walk a little further in before you take off your shoes. And um, hopefully we will track a little less dirt that way. And it's a cuter way to conceal all the shoes instead of having them all over the place in the kitchen. So we're trying to do better, you guys, with the systems that we have here this year. And this was only $15.99. And I feel like it's going to hold so many shoes. It has handles on the side, and it's going to fit in with our like whole aesthetic. All right, in this bag, we have two really cute wreaths that we got from TJ Maxx. I'm obsessed with them both, honestly. So this one we're thinking about putting on the shed porch because a lot of this color will be in the front. We don't want to overpower it too much. So this is just a way to tie in the front with like a cute little shed back there. So this one was only $16.99, which is a great deal. And I love the blue color with like the little flowers on here and the greenery. And then the back is like straw. So it's perfect for spring and like a cute knot to Easter. And then we also got this one, which I'm thinking might go on the front door, like our actual front door. But now that I'm looking at it, I'm not so sure. This might go on the kitchen door instead or above the stove in the kitchen. Cause I don't feel like this is front door worthy once we get it all like whimsically and cottagey for spring. I'm still gonna be on the hunt for one. Cause I'd like for the front door wreath to just have like a lot more whimsical florals like trailing everywhere. I may have to make something like that. Because yeah, I would like for it to be like that. And also it'd be cute too. There's like a little sign here, you know, that says hello or welcome or please knock or whatever. So we'll see. I'm looking around and I feel like we hit on everything. So I will have the links for everything that I can link down below. The only thing that might be hard to link is like Hobby Lobby. Oh wait y'all, wait, hold on. Hold on y'all. Almost forgot about my Walmart stuff. It'll be quick. These two little balls from Walmart. Walmart now has like a little dollar section y'all. Well, nothing over there is a dollar though. It's like three or five bucks. But I love the little scallops on these and the speckles. I thought they were so cute. Three bucks a piece. And my new favorite thing because your girl like has to up her water intake. So I got this water bottle and I love the sage color. It was only seven bucks. I know all the girls are raving about a sandwich. I can never get my hands on one. I see like the convenience of having a handle, which would be nice, but this one is so cute and easy and I kind of walk around like this with it all the time now. 
I just started using it a few days ago and the amount of water that I've been drinking just by having a cute water bottle with a straw mm. definitely pick up one of these cute little water bottles they come in blue they come in pink gray and then this sage color which I think is perfect for spring and the wood top though it's just a vibe so I love this so much and did I mention it's only seven bucks at Walmart so yeah so that is officially everything. Thank you guys so much for tuning in for this video. I was really inspired to just sit down and film it. So I think going forward, that's what I'm gonna try to do. Like whenever I'm in a good mood and I feel like pushing some content out for you guys, I'm just gonna sit down and get it done. And in those moments of not feeling it, of course, you guys will understand why. So. I really hope you guys enjoy. I hope to see you next Sunday with a new video. We'll see. Um, but follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you haven't already because I want to post more stuff over there behind the scenes like I used to. Love you guys. Bye.